Hello guys, welcome to another video. This is your girl Haima. Haima here. <laughs> so in today's video, it will be short, simple and straight to the point. No lippy lippy, no laba laba. Pardon me for the bonnet because I woke up not long ago. I just took my bath and I said, why don't I video this before I do anything else? Yeah. So I know a lot of people when they travel outside, they're like, oh. I'm craving for African food and things like that. Yes. <laughs> so I got some few stuff from the African shop that I would like to be like, yeah, show it to you guys. And in China, it's not like other places like the America, uh, UK that you have a physical shop where you can get African food stuff. In China, it's not like that. If you want to get food from home you would have to order them on WeChat or some people do have shops on Taobao so if you don't know in China mostly we order things online <laughs> we have the physical markets though like the local market the the supermarket but there are some things that you can never get on on like physical market so we mostly buy them online and buying things online is relatively cheaper to me as compared to buying them at the physical shop because the physical shop some of the their things are very expensive and there are some things that you can never get from the physical shop unless you buy them online and i think one other reason is getting a shop in china because no it's not getting a shop doing some things as a foreigner in china it's complex like sophisticated you need a lot of processing you have to go through a lot of process that is why i think most people don't want to get shops so they mostly sell them on wechat so maybe they have it in their home so they advertise on their wechat if you want you just contact them by wechat then they send it by quite deep that is the delivery to you yes <laughs> so i think i'm talking too much yeah so basically that but for me me you see you see as i do like this before i order anything i have to do a lot of research i do a lot of research into buying things like the like the cheapest places and the best place to buy this where to buy this where not to buy this i compare prices a lot i don't like cheap things so but <laughs> there's uh, sometimes you have to minimize cost that like, to the, the lowest that is i'm a logistician <laughs> that, that is why i'm a transport engineer i can't i can't just buy things because okay i have the money so i buy anything i want okay let me not no you have to compare prices sometimes to get the cheaper offer so that you save some money to buy other things you, see, you know what i mean so i don't like cheap things so it's not like me i like cheap things no I don't like cheap things. Okay, so let's move right into it. So, <laughs> some few stuffs and um, and like I don't mostly buy everything at the African shop. There is only one African shop that I buy my things from because to me their things are uh, cheaper than the rest of the the other shops on WeChat. The other shops their things are expensive and I think Kumi Moreva the person is a Ghanaian so supporting a brother you know you get it so we are supporting the brotherhood like <laughs> and some of these things are from ghana so we buy to support the economy <laughs> yeah so let's move right into it so i i got this this is the first item on the list i got this this noodle this is not from back home like this is not from ghana this is actually a chinese because it's not needle nestle is not it's not an african company let me put it like that it's a worldwide something so this this i got it from here it's not i got i didn't get it from the african market i didn't buy them it's from the african market i got it elsewhere i got pinned or door then i think it's from i i don't know the country flag 
but I got it from uh, Pendor Door and the writings are in Chinese and it is just like the one we have back home so why don't I spend a few bucks on this to get what I need this is the first on the list this video and I got Milo uh, this is not from back home I think this is from Vietnam because of the writings you see the writings and the reason why I said that is I see this writing here because I have like colleagues yeah in my class they are from Vietnam and they, yeah it sounds like this I'm not saying that it's happening <laughs> but so I got this yes yeah aha oh aha so see Vietnam here they have Vietnam here so I got this also and this is around 20 something quite I'll, maybe I'll list like I'll put the prices there this is around 20 something quite and this was around 40 or 50 something this is around 20 something cheap yeah and I got this so uh, like I I got from I think an Arabian shop on Taba because it has a lot of Arabic like Arabic writings you see even this is in Arabic the this all these ones everything and it's not like the one we have back home let me just say this up it's not like I'll, let me be truthful it's not like the one we have back home it's a bit sugary it's a bit sweet for my liking i know i'm a sweet sweet i like sweet stuff but this is too sweet i don't like my cereals to be sweet i like a moderate but this is, is a like, sweet i've already opened it right and i've tasted it so i've opened it already but well we've bought it and no food can go waste you know so we have to make good use of it we'll still be enjoying it even though it's not what we expected <laughs> we'll still be enjoying it you know so yes and i got this also Ta -da! <laughs> i got this dry fish i have forgotten the the english name I can't kill myself. I can't kill myself. It's not by force. I can't kill myself. Of course, I know. Don't say I don't know. I know. But I forgot it. I got this from the Chinese shop. See, there are some things that you can get from the Chinese shop which are like cheaper. Yeah, because there are some things that the Chinese people use for their food which we also use in our like preparing our food. So you can get something like this. I buy this for my shito and this is the first time I'm getting this brand. It's in Chinese. Don't tell me to read because what's in the Of course I can speak a little bit of Chinese but I'm not fluent. And I got this and I see of course I see of course I see this character is high like is it ocean? or the maritime the sea or something because my school is high shit high shit so i see this this is the character for high and this is oh of course ah, I'm, 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 let's do some let, let's do some chinese classes here yeah let me teach you you, know, you see that too. so i see this this is shan this is the character for shan this is the character for shi i think she's like city and this is a character for Shin. New. Like Shinda. Shinda. So, I don't know for this. So, I said New High. City. Okay, this means High. Shan, like Shanghai. This is the character for Shan. So, if you combine this character and this character, you get Shanghai. You get it. This is Shan. This is High. So, this is Shanghai. Oh, of course. I'm teaching you this side. You could have paid though, but I'm just doing it for you for free. And this is Fa. Meaning big. That high, ah, I don't know the rest of the characters, but I know if you combine this and this, this and this, you get Shanghai. <laughs> that is high. So, this plus this plus this is Shanghai City. So, this plus this plus this is Shanghai Shi, meaning Shanghai City. Happy <laughs> birthday!
<laughs> yes, <laughs> Chinese class 101. Only on this channel <laughs> that you get this tutorials. You won't get it anywhere, anywhere. So don't forget to like, to subscribe, and to comment. Okay. So let's move to the other one. Other one. I got. Of course, I got this for my shito. This for my shito. If you don't know shito, if you're not a Ghanaian, you don't know shito. It's spicy black sauce made with a lot of things like it's a condiment and it's superb superb it is fantabulous extraordinary <laughs> you need to try it <laughs> but if you want to try it you have to get it from the right source don't just eat any shito and be there be complaining that eh, Ghanaian shito is not nice eat from the proper source eat from like good ones yeah. You enjoy it. I know you enjoy it. I know. I know you try it. Eh? I know you should try it. <laughs> okay, let's move on. And of course, you can't touch it all with just with uh, dry fish. You need to get some shrimp, dry shrimp. So I got this also from the Chinese shop. It says seafood. Enjoy the fish. So it's also does it have some bit of uh characters see i see this is i don't know if it is what i'm thinking let me not disgrace myself okay ah i know ah see the da and hi it's also here then this is da so da hi da ah i know i know this character but i've forgotten oh. okay that is it it's okay no more chinese lessons Person can come and disgrace in Zef. You can come and disgrace as Zef. So I got this shrimp. 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 Dry shrimp. They actually dry. So I'm going to blend it for my shit. I like to get my things fresh. Then I do it myself. And another thing. I got. Yes. I got it from the Chinese shop. Like a Chinese shop on Pindwodo. And it's spicy. They have different all these people they don't like spicy foods. When they eat spicy food, they'll be scratching their hair. So even if they are sell like when they are selling pepper or la. Yeah, they call it la. They like to sell la jiao. They like to sell like in grates from the mild ones to the spiciest. So I like to buy the spicy ones because I like my shit to always be spicy. A typical Ghanaian lady. That is <laughs> spiciness is good though of course she thought she'd be spicy because it's spicy black sauce yes so i like my my she thought to be spicy so i buy the spicy pepper and uh we got this also yes i know a lot of you know this a lot of you know this this is neat food A typical Ghanaian lady. We want to have everything we have back home here. I got this from Don't Call Me, the, the African shop that I mostly buy my things. I got this from them. It's cheaper. You won't get it like the the price we have back home, of course. But to me, I think it's it's cheaper. It's around 45 quai. And so if you want to buy, you can buy from them. And of course, you pay for shipping. So what I mostly do is, I buy a lot. I don't buy like just one. I buy a lot of things so that the shipping cost will be a bit lower. So I I bought this, and this is the plantain fufu, meat fufu. Of course, you have to eat good. You get it. You, should, you shouldn't just be concentrating on the money, the money, the money. You not be enjoying. Oh no. You have to enjoy you, my brother, my sister. You have to enjoy yourself. Enjoy. Enjoy yourself. So I got this. I got this. I two of these. <laughs> yes. And but if you don't like the need to food and you want to maybe you do the um food processor for food, of course you can get plantain and cassava here. But one thing is 
they are planting it's not like the one we have back home it's short mm? <laughs> it's short it's just like banana it's called indian banana it's short well as long as you get the result that you want why not so we buy that one too you can buy if you're in china you can buy that one and the plant you they have cassava because they use cassava for bread here in china so you can get the cassava the plantain if you have a food processor you just blend and you you boil you do the blending and everything then get the fufu we have back home right and another thing another thing yes a typical Ghanaian home like <laughs> you can't go to a typical Ghanaian home and not see palm oil even not just Ghanaians Nigerians I would say Western no Africans I don't maybe Western Central Africans the Eastern parts like the like the East African the South Africans but I know for Central and West like West Africa they mostly like using palm oil in their food we use palm oil for so many things but the most important one is gobe use the this is so much like oh my god oh, palm oil so if you want to buy palm oil and this was made in ghana see home fresh and it's from Tema. that is why i buy because it's nice the shop that I mostly buy my palm oil from, they have three types. They have the Zumi, they have the normal one, and there is another one in the sachet. But I prefer buying this one because so I mostly like buying this one. I prefer buying this to the other one. So if you are in China and want to buy, I recommend this. This one is this advert has been vetted and approved by Haima Arena. <laughs> Hi, ma so if you want to buy good palm oil, buy this only one. This is my much nicer than the other one. Yeah. And what do we have on our list? <laughs> oh, do more, do more, do more, do more. Let's dance on my piano. Is it on my piano? Doing that dance for this diary. I actually love this diary because I got two. I got two. So I like this diary for two reasons. One, because it was made in Ghana. Two, because it doesn't give that kick. <laughs> that that kick like that yeah, you, you get what I mean. It, like some guy they give that that sharp kick here. No, this diary doesn't give that kick. So I just love it. I love the Gary. And uh, you see, I don't know for those in Accra or those in other places in Ghana, but in Takare, if you are buying Gary, they'll be like, this is, um, I, I want a Gary. I want a Gary. And mostly those I want a Gary, it's smooth, so like very nice. So I would say to me, this is a Huna Gary because it's smooth. And it tastes nice it's very nice especially when you use it for uh curry soakings and my other baby i'll tell you about it my other baby food i'll tell you about it yeah so this is nice and it's for don't call me this is the symbol like the shop that i mostly buy my african food from so this is don't come here yeah. where african shop in china and it's okay i think this is one kg so i bought two kg this is one kg and it's i think the two was the two kg was around 64 something maybe you can't complain you can't complain yes you have to buy it like that if you want to enjoy so i bought two and the last and the rest is this bado. This, this one. Yeah. Black eyed beans. Black eyed beans. I got this from the Chinese shop because the Chinese people they have they use this thing for their food. I got this from for the from the Chinese shop. They, they have their own food that they use the black eyed beans for and it's cheaper than getting it from the African shop. 
so I got this from the Chinese shop and it was two actually. This is I think the two was by two point five kg. No, it was five kg, the two was five kg. So this is two point five kg and the other one was also two point five kg. So I mostly buy those and keep them like for my business. So I, I got this also. So if you see this you see this <laughs> And you see where that I am. You see this thing. You know where the game is going, right? <laughs> Go be <there>, Alex. <laughs> I don't need to tell you. You don't need to be told that. Yes, son. I mean, kind of bad. I don't need to tell you about it. You know where the, the thing is going. I Go be Alex. <laughs> so, I, I was telling my sister some time back that I think, I personally think that those that brought about this gobe idea i know by now they are dead but i personally think that they should their family should be honored because they did a brilliant job eh? this food that is a lifesaver eh? <laughs> that like gobe is the only food that i can eat throughout the week i won't get tired i won't get tired I think their family should be honored and yet in Ghana we have the Founders Day celebration right and it's it's a public holiday I think those that brought Kobe they should be honored in the same way the, the leader of that gang his his or her birthday should be a public holiday in Ghana yes if you agree with me let me know in the comment section okay <laughs> yeah <laughs> so this is the end of the video i hope you like it and don't forget to give me this and don't forget to subscribe to comment and to share as well see you in my next video and be blessed